but it's a very big day for a lot of folks all across the state, uh, folks who will be getting potentially today the first dose of the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. And uh, we received some new video into our newsroom from Intermountain Healthcare officials, which shows that the vaccine, this brand new uh, one dose uh, administered shot arriving here in the state of Utah on Tuesday, the state's largest hospital system officials there, they will start administering those one shot doses sometime today. In the meantime, the University of Utah Healthcare System officials there telling Fox 13 that they received a limited amount of Johnson & Johnson shots. They plan to start using them uh, coming up at the beginning of next week on Monday. In Farmington, South Jordan and Sugar House Health Center, Morningstar Hospital says they have not yet scheduled to, uh, to really have any of those doses on hand and to administer them, at least not yet. Now, all of this coming as a demand for the vaccine surges all across the state. In Utah County, in particular, health department officials say they are getting swamped with calls and messages from folks who are not eligible for the vaccine yet, but they are still trying to get a vaccination appointment. They're asking folks to please remain calm, remain patient, and check first to see if you are in that qualifying range before you tie up very valuable resources, uh, tying up the phone lines and things of that nature. And the state, they're holding its weekly update today on COVID-19, you know, uh, both the case counts, uh, deaths, and of course, uh, right now, the good news, all the shots that are being administered, uh, who can get them and where. Uh, that happens today at 11. We'll be, you know, carrying that obviously on Fox 13 News live at 11. And then afterwards, if you can't make that, we'll have uh, the information on our website, fox13now.com. For now, we're live in Salt Lake City. Scott McCain, Fox 13 News, Utah.